A popular fall attraction is helping one Trumpelow family raise awareness on type 1 diabetes. News 8 Now's Jeremy Wall has this story. Jeremy. Well, Emily, Christina and Ryan Schwirtle opened a corn maze on their farm one year ago. Each year, the maze offers a different theme. This year, it's type 1 diabetes, a sickness that hits close to home. Kinley Schwirtle is 11 years old. She enjoys helping out on her family farm, feeding animals and tending to day-to-day -day chores with her parents. In 2023, she started showing signs of diabetic ketoacidosis, a complication where the body isn't able to produce enough insulin. I know up until the day she was diagnosed, um, before that she was really, really thirsty and she had lost a little bit of weight. Um, and so I just knew something was off. She, it just was not characteristic of the stomach flu. And I just, little alarms were going off in my head that this is something different and we needed her to get checked out. Kinley went to urgent care where she was diagnosed with type 1 diabetes. It's not lifestyle related like um, type 2 diabetes where it could be if you're not active or eating things that you're not supposed to be eating. It's just when the body no longer works at its highest level. The body also goes after islet cells, causing prevention of insulin and blood sugar to rise. Kinley now has to wear a patch and a pump. The patch gives her blood sugar reading so her pump can give her insulin. Since her diagnosis, the family has paid closer attention to food labels and nutrition facts. There are a lot of kiddos affected with type 1 diabetes. Um, before Kinley was diagnosed, we did not know what it was at all. So I think it's really important that uh, we get the word out there. Schwertle Family Farms operates as a greenhouse and seasonal roadside stand. Last year, the family created a maze to entertain folks and raise awareness about different issues. This year, it's type 1 diabetes. Placing signage near the maze to spark conversations about it. And we talk about it and um, people understand it's nothing to be scared of or afraid of. Um, there's lots of kiddos that have it, so let's uh, support them and celebrate them. A portion of all tickets to the corn maze will benefit the Chad Erickson Thunder Ride for Juvenile Diabetes, a nonprofit helping families whose children are impacted by the disease. The maze is open until the end of the month. The Schwirtles plan to have more fundraisers in the future to raise awareness of type 1 diabetes.